got to back it up, though. Big left hook by Trinidad, and Vargas is stunned. Vargas is stunned and down. Sensational left hook. Trinidad can't go to the wheel. He's not playing around now. Second knockdown. Okay. This is what Felix said he'd do. No three knockdown rule in effect. Punished to the body for seven or eight rounds. This is an unusual situation. Now he got hurt by a right hand. Deadly and quick as Tito Trinidad. And Trinidad did everything he could to finish it right then and there. Give Vargas credit for showing some stability. Despite being down twice. And now Vargas tries to rake Trinidad out of the way of those punches. How he does it, you don't know. Right hand lands for Trinidad. Vargas pops back with a left. Get his legs back under him. That's what he should be doing. There was a brutal body shot by Trinidad that set up this assault, but Vargas is able to duck. And this is one of the first times you've seen Trinidad try to sprint early like this. Trinidad holding on to Vargas's right arm as Vargas whacked away with the left. Best rally of the fight for Fernando. He's ready to take off on you and go. Some of us really expected Vargas to be at angles and not. And he's been taking too many punches. Oh, right good there. right hand. Throw your right hand before There's you throw something your look. Wrong with Trinidad's right eye. Sees a chance and bangs away with the left. One of, one of Hard right hand by Trinidad. Right into the right eye of Trinidad. The first round. The young fighter seems to have gotten his feet under him. He takes a low blow. Keeps motioning Vargas back into the corner. Now Fernando wants to come out and fight. I really think it was Fernando uh, Vargas who had the momentum going before the stop. You got to give him two extra points, and down goes Tito. The fight was before, it just changed. Here comes Trinidad to try to follow up. I mean, check it, Vargas to try to follow up. Trinidad in trouble, he wasn't going to let him off the hook. He got another low blow. Right now, Jim, it's a three-point round for Vargas. Round four continues. Big left to the body. Felix backing straight up. Takes another left hook. From what I've seen in the corner, they're telling Tito that his eye looks okay. What you want him to do, spread that leg. What Good left hook by Vargas. Left hook to the body by Vargas. Close to the belt line. At this time, Trinidad should be establishing much more effective at range right now. This is a dominant round was a thumb because there are no thumbs on these gloves, Jim, but it was a glove. That's what Fernando would prefer. Oh, well, let him say it. We can't do it. Trinidad making a comeback now in round six after having been thoroughly dominated in three, four, and five. And Vargas, who was moving away early in the round, elects to trade with Trinidad and gets the better of him for the moment. Amazing. 55-55, three rounds apiece. Tito Trinidad definitely caught up in round six. Now Vargas got to understand that these ladder rounds belong to Trinidad. You've got to box him. Another low blow. And another point deduction against Trinidad. A little short with that. Now, now he lands one All in the night he's been waiting for that. battle and it's been good all left to the body by Vargas. Trinidad was hurting the body and he went after it. He hit him again in the same spot right above the the, the trunk line there. Body punching. This Ten is... seconds left in the round now. They come down the stretch of the round and Vargas momentarily hurt because he stops and thinks for a second. With the swelling. He hasn't blown his nose as like he did. You want to make sure you throw up because you're in the middle of the ring. A right hand from distance momentarily wobbles Vargas. Another combination. Vargas grabs and holds. Another big right hand by Trinidad. Vargas in trouble. He stands and... Another left to the body by Vargas. And that backs Trinidad up. That's what you want, Trinidad. You want to back him away. Make another him back up. To the body by Make Vargas. him back up. And another left to the body. Trinidad to the ribs. Right here. Right here. It's toughness of Vargas against
I'm not the kind of fighter who'll run. I'll stand with him. I'll trade with him. I'll stay with him all the way. That's what Vargas does as he comes down the stretch in round nine. Three rounds to go. Harold, both rounds were very close. One of the judges for this fight, Glenn Hamada, was also a judge for Trinidad De La Hoya, and he had that fight, 114-114. Had another extremely close fight tonight. And a one-point deduction for Vargas. Vargas is throwing low punches, too. He probably was, and then you caution your referee, if you're a good commission, to be equal here. And that's not a bad for Don King to try to make his point. Mark Ratner, the executive director of the Nevada State Athletic Commission, was two seats away. Meanwhile, they're still busting each other. Now, Trinidad has definitely had the edge in power. Well, then how's he going to win the fight, George? Passion, commitment, pride, and absolute determination all the time. Try to match my will. That's what Felix Trinidad... Good left hook inside by Vargas. Vargas with a momentary flash of offense. There you go, Vargas. He's beating him to the punch, and he's rattling him. He's got his heart. He's got his power. Trinidad. Jim, there's no question. Out of the last four rounds, Tito Trinidad is released. Three. Down goes Vargas. Fernando Vargas must score a knockout, or he's lost this fight. Down goes Fernando. From instinct and courage. He's what? out of it. He can't see Trinidad. He's about to get knocked out. Fernando trying to survive. Fires a couple of punches and holds on like a skilled veteran. He's a veteran. And that'll do it. The third right hand, the third knockdown of the round. A huge victory for Tito Trinidad. He closes the show. Perfect left hand shot on the button by Felix Trinidad. And then seconds later, the second knockdown and the one that made it clear that Vargas would need a near miracle just to finish the fight. And a merciful Jay Nady, not bothering to count, but rather stepping in to end the onslaught and spare the brilliant young talent any further punishment at the hands of the devastating Trinidad. And now the WBA and the IBF 154-pound world champion Felix Tito 